If you don't have crane time and you aren't going to hike, then bottom-up building is the recommended method for your assembly. Both methods 1 and 2 engineer out some of the hazards of height with more productive building on the ground methods. Step 1. Assemble the decks using EFCO Z-beam and E-beam along with contractor supplied plywood for each tower to be set up. All this work can be done safely on the ground. A job built fixture may prove efficient in the assembly operation. The elaborateness of the assembly fixture depends upon the quantity of easy deck panels required for the project and can give consistent dimensions easily. Lay out the Z-beam stringers first and then add the E-beams on top. Bolt each connection using the EFCO 3 quarter by 1 and 3 quarter inch quick bolt. Plywood can be attached to the EFCO E-beam quickly and easily with E-beam nails or for a more secure attachment, self-drilling screws. Ask your district EFCO engineer or field supervisor for an EFC 985 publication listing nail and screw options. Four to six fasteners will attach each 4x8 sheet depending on your job requirements. Consider the increased dismantling time and effort when more fasteners are used. Nail options for a single pour have a pull-out force between 160 and 180 pounds. Other nail options for a more durable setup and multiple pours have a pull-out force between 365 to 410 pounds. In addition, Screw options have a pull-out force between 500 and 525 pounds. Fasteners easily hammer into E-beams, but you may consider the labor-saving cost of a nail gun, depending on your job requirements. At this point, the deck panel assemblies may be stacked for future use when required in Step 6. This may also be a good time to add handrails to some deck panels. Step 2. On the ground, install the easy shore panels on the two post assemblies for the long sides of the shore tower. For your project, establish the correct distance from the ends of the easy shore post assemblies to the easy panel and cut gauge blocks for spacing. Step 3. Install easy shore panels for the short sides of the tower on the previously assembled sections. The easy shore panels should be at right angles to the long side frames, sticking straight up from the ground. Step 4. Install the third and fourth easy shore posts using the gauge block for correct location of the panel. For bottom up building, for setups with multiple Easy Deck section requirements, add the sections by repeating steps two through four. Each time, bolt each leg section together using the Easy Deck machine bolt. Step five, install the remaining Easy Shore panels to complete the tower assembly. Install U-head brackets and either the EFCO long or short top jack adjusting the jack wing nuts to the proper height for your job requirements. Make sure the bolts in the U-head brackets are tight if you plan on walking on the decks. Step 6. Stand the tower on end and fly the pre-assembled deck panel into place and bolt to the U-head brackets. Plumb and grade the deck by adjusting the wing nuts on the bottom jacks.